Hey what's up guys this is your power back again today's video is about ectomorph okay so someone who's a hard gainer who cannot gain weight or cannot gain muscles who's skinny okay so i get this question a lot how do i gain muscles when i'm really skinny and i cannot gain weight okay the first thing let me you know there are three body types there's ectomorph mesomorph endomorph so ectomorphs are on the very you know they are really skinny and really thin and they are really difficult to gain weight okay mesomorphs are genetically gifted wish i could be a mesomorph so they have you know a good body structure you could see they are you know abs they, they have rounded shoulders so they, it's genetically they are really good wish i could be okay and someone who's you know endomorph who gains weight easily who eats a candy and he, he can gain weight so someone who can gain weight okay so we are talking about someone who's an ectomorph okay if you could see the picture over here you would understand you know different body types okay someone who's an ectomorph who can't really gain weight okay and cannot gain muscles so first let me get back to how do they gain muscles or how do they gain weight okay so guys it all depends on your calories okay so you all must be having a high metabolism rate so you all must be burning a a lot of high calories so i mean so if you want to gain muscles guys you need to eat above that above your maintenance calorie level okay so i say it in all my videos your body requires certain amount of calories just to be just to maintain your current weight okay the why we eat food is food has calories and calories help us to survive okay we are built for survival okay guys our body is designed to survive so we need we all request certain amount of calories just to maintain our weight okay so if we eat above that you would gain weight and if you eat below that you would lose weight okay so for someone who's ectomorph their maintenance calories is really high okay so make sure you eat above your maintenance calorie but i get this question a lot yeah what trust me i eat this much okay guys maybe you are eating one day that much but the next day you're eating this much so make sure you count your calories make a journal write down what you eat every day okay a really good book for you all must be you know is starting strength okay so in this he talks about this the author talks about you know you know people who are really hard gainers they need to have you know one gallon of milk every day with regarding you know with 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 normal food they have and it's a really good book so you should read about it anyways my tips on it guys just count out your calories and and you know just eat above your maintenance calorie and trust in the process guys if you eat every day the same amount of food and above your maintenance calories you would gain weight you would gain muscles there's no such thing as you know i'm not gaining weight okay you just need to eat a lot more and you know and if you tell me you know you cannot eat more you need to build in habit okay so one day so if you're having one apple i mean you know if you have one glass of milk next day try try having you know one and a half glass of milk the next day try having you know two glass of milk okay this is how you increase your appetite you, and you know this is how you increase so make sure you know just just progressively you know start eating you can't just eat a big lot of you know food together so make sure you build an habit and just count your calories how much you are eating every day just a rough figure or just write down you know how much you are eating and trust me within you know and track down everything if track down your weight every week and then you know you'll start increasing your weight okay now let's get back to your workout okay so how would you do your workout if you want to gain muscles guys progression is the key progression always can you know consistently increase your weight okay so for any someone who wants to build muscles someone wants to get lean progression overload okay so you all need to increase your weights every time you go to the gym okay so if you see imagine you're doing push ups every day you're doing 10 push ups every day okay you're not increasing your push up okay the whole your past and you will be the same okay so you need to progressively overload so this is how your body you know recovers and builds your muscles okay the, this is the first thing second thing is you should train more often your training frequency should be more often you should train four times a week okay and you should lift you should focus on more compound exercises like deadlift squats you know chest presses but make sure it's really safe for you for me i can't do squats for me because i, I have enjoyed myself so i i do something else i do front squats or bulgarian split squats to so make sure whatever you're comfortable with whatever you can do it okay just don't go in the magazine and like and say like you know all these top bodybuilders are doing that even i could do that okay it might enjoy you whatever you're comfortable with and just progressively overload on that exercises and keep on increasing your weight and trust me you would build muscles avoid uh, high reps okay you don't uh, someone who's a really hard gainer you don't want to do high reps not like doing 40 reps for bicep curls or you know lateral make sure you do heavy 
and low volume workouts. You should take a rest between sets if you're lifting really heavy weights. You should have a longer rest periods around, you know, one to two minutes or one to three minutes between that, whatever you're comfortable with. And I hope this advice really helps you all guys and please hit the subscribe button to support the channel. Yeah, signing off.